began printmaking when I was in high school. My awesome art teacher had a book on printmaking and I saw that there were these huge cardboard prints and I was like, wow, that's amazing. They were relief prints, which is something I've always been interested in, um, like big graphic black prints. And so um, she went ahead and found some cardboard for me and all you needed was an X-Acto knife. So um, she just got me drawing, like I was doing a lot in class already, and so I started cutting my designs and went from there. It's very labor intensive. There's a lot of monotony, which some people can't handle. And I felt like it was more of a um, meditative practice, using my hands, my almost my whole body to kind of um, carve out the negative spaces if I was carving. I love the process. I love having step one, step two, step three, and then breaking those boundaries and coming out of that and, and really manipulating the materials. It just, it makes you so much closer to the work. Um, you use your, your entire physical body instead of just your hand and your eyes. Just the smells and the movements of the studio using old equipment is so romantic and I always, <laughs> I always um, just was attracted to that. It was the community aspects of the print shop, everybody helping each other. Um, sometimes you need more than two hands. So it's, it's just a really nice little um, community, a family outside of your, your real family. This past year has been such a learning experience in all different ways from teaching to working with new equipment. I love that aha moment that students get when you, when you make them understand, when you make them slow down and really think about process and why they're doing something. I think that's the hardest thing to do. But once they get that, that um, immediate relief and excitement is such a reward. And I feel that it's the same for everybody, whether you're in kindergarten, or um, an older individual, they still have that aha moment. Their eyes light up and that's just such a reward. So I want to continue to do that and learn and then hopefully be able to teach um, others through owning my own print shop and having my own assistants and um, continue to make art professionally.